Well, hey, boys and girls, welcome. Welcome once again to the Anchored in Hope Studios. I hope you're having a great week. I have a question for you. When is a little bit a lot? And we're going to talk about that in just a few minutes. But before we do, let's go to Studio A with the rest of the worship team and let's sing a song of worship together. Jesus came and took my sins away I just had to trust him and obey The sins were red as scarlet Now as white as snow He's with me everywhere I go Jesus came and took my sins away have something to share with you today, boys and girls. I was uh, a little hungry, so I was looking around the studio here for a snack, and I found five peanut butter crackers, and I found two candy bars. And I'd like to share them with you, but I'm not sure that everybody watching all over the world, if I could find a way to send you a snack. I don't think that I could feed everybody with five peanut butter crackers and two candy bars. It reminds me of a story in the Bible. If you have your Bibles, turn with me to John 6. John 6, 5 to 13. And Jesus soon saw a huge crowd of people coming to look for him. And turning to Philip, he asked, where can we buy bread to feed all these people? He was testing Philip, for he already knew what he was going to do. And Philip replied, even if we work for months, we wouldn't have enough money to feed them. And then Andrew, Simon Peter's brother, spoke up. There is a young boy here with five barley loaves and two fish. But what good is that with this huge crowd? Tell everyone to sit down, Jesus said. And so they all sat down on a grassy slope. The men alone numbered about 5,000. Then Jesus took the loaves and gave thanks to God and distributed them to the people. Afterwards, he did the same with the fish, and they all ate as much as As they wanted. After everyone was full, Jesus told his disciples, Now gather the leftovers and let nothing be wasted. And so they picked up the pieces and filled twelve baskets of scraps left by the people who had eaten the five barley loaves. Isn't that amazing, boys and girls? What's most amazing about the story is that this little boy was willing to share what he had. He was willing to share his five barley loaves, and barley loaves are 
small, not much bigger than a hot dog bun. And his fish, which were probably about the size of sardines. It's kind of like me taking my five peanut butter crackers and my two candy bars and feeding 5,000 people. We learn in this passage of Scripture, boys and girls, that in Jesus' hands, little can be a lot. He can take what little you have. He can take your talent. He can take your gift. He can take your willingness to help. Even if it's little, even if you're little. And he can use that to do a lot. But we have to be willing to give him what we have. We have to be willing to give him our lives. And if we do that, he can take what little we have and make it a lot. He can take five peanut butter crackers and two candy bars. And he can feed 5,000. And you know what's even more amazing about this story? Is that back then they only counted the men. They didn't count the women and children. And so there were way more than 5,000. Isn't that amazing, boys and girls? The next time you think you don't matter, the next time you think you really can't do anything because you're just little and you don't have a lot, put it in God's hands and let him take your little and make it a lot. God bless you. I look forward to seeing you here again next week. As always, I pray that you have an awesome, awesome week.